AI art is getting really good. Most folks don't care if images are AI, but they do want to know one way or the other. They don't like to be tricked. Enter AI image detectors. They're designed to separate AI created and human created art. But can they really tell the difference? In this video, we're testing AI image detectors. I'll try out the most common AI content and even try to fold in with some of my own photographs. The online art community is buzzing about the creative potential of AI art, but there's also a lot of chatter about banning AI art in certain spaces. I came across a Reddit post where a frustrated artist shared their experience. Their human created art was flagged as AI by an AI image detector, and the artist was banned from the subreddit. The artist insisted their work was 100% handmade and that the AI detector got it wrong. This highlights the real world consequences for artists if the AI detectors fail. I'm very interested to see how my heavily edited fine art photographs do. Will my human created art flag as AI? Let's find out. I tested five online AI image detectors. All of them are easy and free to use. Most offer premium plans, but for casual use, simply drag and drop an image into the AI image detector and you'll quickly see if the image is AI. But the result isn't cut and dried. All the AI image detectors give you the result as a confidence level. How likely the image is to be AI. So it's kind of like the weather. A 10% chance of rain means you might still get wet. The 90% chance that an image is human created means that it could still be AI. Or the reverse. An AI image could still turn out to be human created. For this test, I carefully selected a variety of images, including photographs, digital art created in Photoshop and Blender, human art, including painting and anime drawing, and some of my own fine art photos. To make the test more challenging, I paired each image with a similar AI-generated counterpart. Then I took screenshots of all the images to remove any metadata. So could the AI image detectors tell when a photograph was taken with a camera or was a photograph-like image created in AI? Well, most of the time, but not always. Sometimes the AI image was labeled as a real photograph. Other times the real photograph was flagged as AI. I tested a few of my own fight art photographs, which are highly edited in Photoshop, and found similar results. Most of my photos were labeled as human created, but not always. Sometimes the AI image detector got it wrong. And the AI image detectors couldn't tell when parts of an image were changed in Photoshop. For instance, it couldn't tell when I'd replaced the sky changed a model's face and body shape, and it couldn't identify when parts of the image were added using Photoshop's generative fill tool. AI image detectors are essential tools to find fake photos, but they don't always get it right. Results were also mixed for other types of human-created art. I tested an abstract painting and an anime still. Sometimes the AI-generated image was labeled as human, and the human creations labeled as AI. Sometimes it was a complete toss-up. 
The results were even more up in the air when I tested digital creations. A double exposure image created in Photoshop completely stumped the AI detectors. They struggled to identify the Photoshopped image as human created. Many creators use digital tools like Photoshop and Blender to create their work. The AI image detectors aren't always accurate in identifying these works as human. As a final test, I used an AI created image that I'd heavily manipulated in Photoshop. This exercise was inspired by the US Copyright Office's stance that images need significant human input to qualify as original. I wanted to explore just how much alteration is considered significant. Check out this video to see how I transformed this image. But even though the AI image is altered, the AI image detectors mostly identified it as AI. None of the AI image detectors were 100% accurate, but some were more accurate than others. Illuminati often identified AI images as real and incorrectly identified the human 3D render as AI. On the flip side, was it AI often identified human created images as AI? Hive moderation was generally correct, but got a bit confused with the portraits, thinking the AI one was a photograph. Hive also labeled the human made Photoshop image as AI. Site Engine had the best overall score, but also had trouble with the double exposure pairing, thinking the AI image was human created and wasn't so sure about the Photoshop one. Hive Moderation and Site Engine have tools that tell you which AI image generator created the AI image, but take the results with a grain of salt. They could identify the AI image generator only about half the time. AI image detector made more errors than the other image detectors. Plus the results were the most variable. One day an image might be labeled as AI, the next as human. We've looked at the AI image detectors. Let's flip this around. Is one AI image generator better at fooling the AI image detectors? In a final test, I created images in 10 of the most popular AI image generator using the same prompts. Images in Stable Diffusion were always identified. But images created in the other nine AI image generators fooled the AI detectors at least some of the time. AI-generated portraits were the most difficult to detect, even those that were obviously AI. The Firefly portrait fooled four out of five of the AI image detectors. So can AI detectors really spot the difference between AI and human art? Well, our tests show that they can, but they're definitely not perfect. They can get tripped up pretty easily mixing up both AI and human-made images. Remember that artist on Reddit whose work was wrongly flagged as AI? That's not just a technical glitch, it's someone's career and reputation at stake. AI image detectors can be useful tools, but we can't treat their results as gospel. If you've had an experience with an AI image detector, let us know in the comments below and put the AI image detectors through your own tests and let us know what you find out. As AI technology continues to advance, we desperately need accurate and reliable methods of identifying AI-generated content. Until then, artists and creators need to stay informed and proactive in protecting their work. This is Jen at Making AI Magic. Let's make something amazing together.